Hi friends, now we are going to talk about how we can create a query by which we can find a particular configuration request a value that suppose we want to find a particular plant whether that has moved and what are the different configuration that has been done in that plant. Uh, also for a company code or for payment terms or purchasing group, you name it. Okay, so let's let's try to build it so first thing is you go to sqvi okay and here we're going to build so i already built one so i'll just create one so that everyone can see it from scratch so here first thing is i will just put get config patient request for e values okay so now i'll do table join okay now this is the, the trickiest part once you built so here is the table join and here we will add these tables so first thing we will add is the table let's since we already created one i'll just check what are the tables that we are going to do first is e071k uh, okay so i'll just add e071k that's it and then i'll put this one and the next one is this one cus act obg so here we have to find the joining condition the joining condition is this oops so i'll just put the joining condition that's the joining condition and that the next one is the uh, the text okay so i'll just put this these three okay and here you can see these are the three now i'll go back I mean, half job is done now we have to find what we want to put in the layout so i'll just change this and i'll just copy it from the other one that i created okay so here list fields and i cop sorry i'll just copy it so here you can see these are the fields that i want to do so same thing i'll do from here so i'll just do this project object object name and of course view name tab key this is important uh, probably we can get some more things okay for sure i want this activity uh, i want probably the t code also t code and we can say we can give other stuff but what we important is this brass the language and we want of course uh, the description okay and we can get the decode out okay so these are the fields are there okay now in the selection fields what what we really want is we'll again change it we'll just put pro object object name and of course tab key the view name probably let me see uh, we just need to copy make sure this is the same thing so object object name view name tab key so let's go here object name view name tab key and what's the next one uh, and six seven text and the language okay so i'll just go text and language so here and here if you want you can build t code whatever you want okay so so i'll just put this and that's it we are done now we'll save it and now we'll click on execute simple and here so first once we execute it will come in the selection screen criteria now here what first we are going to do we are going to a purchase order field so let me go there suppose i go to me 23 n okay. and here shows up shows up so here me 23 n here shows up so suppose i will i want to see the org data and suppose I want to see first thing is uh, I want to see is purchase organization or I want to see suppose the plant 1710 so 1710 is the plant we know what is the config table for plant it's t 1 w okay and if you don't know you can also search with this okay so what we can do is here object name we'll just put star 1710 and I do an f8 and here you can see all the configuration that has been done these are the transpose that are associated with it so you can find 
from here you can know what are the different type of modules are being used related to clamps so now suppose at some point you don't know now you want to do for the company code imagine you can have the same name number it's ideally the same company code and the same um, uh, plant so here you can search all the stuffs that has been configured for here now if you don't know a particular con table name like the plant name table name and the company code table name you just can do a wild card and you can find everything but there you can get lots of other stuff that may not be required okay it might be uh, like you can see here there are stuffs related with personal areas and this is just a wild card entry so there is there are stuffs they have probably created a personal areas for that particular plant so which is really great you can find all these things so from here you can uh, find other stuffs like if i want to find suppose all the um, all the um, uh, purchasing group so if i execute i can get all the purchasing groups that has been configured and has moved through transport so in this way you can do a lot of investigation and find out the missing transfers because you will need it day in day out if you are a consultant working as a functional consultant and you can get all these details so that's it stay tuned to my sap channel and happy sap learning and if you like it share and subscribe to it and have a great day